Hello everyone, good morning. So today is part two of my extreme room makeover. If you still hadn't watched part one, you can check it out there. You know, check it out there where I began cleaning up, adding some materials slowly but surely here and there. And um, today, on this day, originally it's gonna be painting day, but it's not gonna be painting day because the bed is going to be fixed right now. It's going to um, make my room a little bit more chill, relaxed. So the bed frame is gonna be constructed today and I'm really, really excited for that. And the fact that I can really lie down properly now instead of the usual sofa that I used to have back then. I sold it now by the way on every marketplace so you won't be able to see it anymore. So hope it's very, you know, hope it's safe with a new friend. I want a, a man's trash is not a man's treasure person. Yeah. So yeah, here is a montage of the set building of the bed frame. I forgot to I meant to say I wasn't able to uh, record the process of them um, building the bed frame and this shelf over here at the back I'm gonna show you guys later because I was treadmilling I was exercising during that time and as you guys can see I am sweating like balls right now because we are we cleaned this place up after the fact that they went home because it's time already for them to go home there's a lot of sodas so I was wearing this mask while cleaning up and with my mom so thank you po mama for helping me clean this up and surprisingly there's so much great stuff already let me guys show you around so in detail here is the shelf that they have built a while ago during the whole day they built this one and the sh and the bed but let's go for the shelf first so this is the shelf originally it's gonna be a floating shelf but because it might be unstable and it might look off to me they decided to build a shelf like this and surprisingly it looks better than what i anticipated and the first shelf is already done it's already all stitched in see it's stitching there and the last shelf the other shelf i plan to put on top is still going to be done next tuesday because as i said they only come here on tuesdays so yeah we still have to wait on that and so far, the progress is doing good. And in the day, they only not just did the shelf, but also the bed because this was the main focus that the bed frame is supposed to be done today so that there'll be at least some progress. So here's the bed frame for me. It was supposed to be by the edge, but there is an extension wire socket over there so we cannot do that. And we need that to, you know, make the TV and everything work in here. So the drawings over there are supposed to be like the guide for where we could put the shelf underneath and then the TV. And then above it would be another floating shelf because I do love my floating shelves. And I also decided to let them install on here a drawer look how that smoothly slides in so far it's doing good as you guys can see look how beautiful it is and for extra storage i decided to put it there suppose that it's going to be on here but i have a mirror on this area so we're going to put it here remember the plywood over here that is covering the little hole over here they decided to put a little box over here which makes it more professional and more better for me like it looks so seamless loki it's nice and i love it you know and it doesn't remove. The good news is it doesn't remove. Because one issue I had with this is that it always opens, leaving ants to come into my room, which obviously sucks. But now it doesn't, and I'm so happy. So yeah, that's probably it. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye. <laughs> Hello, it's me again. Second coding is 
done. Look how white the room is right now. Like, it's literally white. You know, I feel like this will be better with the flooring, with the vinyl flooring that we will put in there soon. The shelf is painted. There'll be another shelf over there and another shelf over there that they'll paint next week because the carpenter only comes every Tuesday and we have to wait till next week for that. And they will continue to paint these tomorrow, I think, so that we can be able to distinguish that it is a shelf and stuff, which is very amazing. We decided to paint even the edges of the window white because, I don't know, it's just pretty neat. And I want the window as well to match with the white kind of cozy team that we have over here. And, you know, it's amazing. I really, really, really love it. So this is the last coating. I think this is the last coating na. And grabe no. Sobrang night and day difference from before. Parang feeling ko na I am more comfortable. And you know, it just feels more me. You know, it's simple but it speaks a lot, you know. It brightens up the room. And look how beautiful they did it. And I'm so happy that I chose a color white. At first I was hesitant because I think we had been too bright. But look, it's still bright even though I close the lights. So they also varnish this desk. Although it is okay already if I like it. However, I just don't like how overly red wood it is, how saturated it is. So I might ask Papa to buy me a new wallpaper for this tabletop right here. The top here because I do want it to just be like a muted wood like a light oak wood just like how I see Pinterest tables do it so remember the black grid that I showed you guys in part one before the video ended it was previously black right and I told them to paint it white and look how the vibe changed so quickly so right now we're just waiting for this paint to dry I don't know if they're going to redo this or this is automatically perfect uh, painted the back and that's pretty much it for your daily updates uh, see you guys tomorrow if we're gonna do something if not we'll I'll just see you guys when we will do something shop for stuff maybe and yeah Everyone. So we're here now at Wilson's Depot with Papa. Papa. Hi. <laughs> so we are here to buy some flooring and uh, um, some stuff for the room. And we're just gonna look around and see what happens. Also some wallpaper and some stuff that we can find here if we can. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys later when we find something really great. <laughs> bye bye. While we were in Wilcon Depot, look at the options of the flooring the wallpaper that we are trying to find and the brackets the handles etc it's a really great place to actually shop for home supplies here it's a really great home depot near us and i'm really happy many hours later <laughs> As you guys said, so, so, so. As you guys saw a while ago, we just removed this hanging shelf for a while. It is, it is not really sticking in there yet because it's not yet really the final position. Maybe we will repaint this area. Maybe of next few days, who knows? Anyways, um, we are going to put a wallpaper that we got from Wilcon Depot a while ago on this table right here. We're gonna put it here and we're just gonna cover this area up with the light oak kind of wallpaper that we have and I'm really excited for that because it's something that I really, really love. I love the shading, I love the idea of this table, it's getting better than what I expected and also the shelf over here, we will put it above a little bit so that it wouldn't distract the table itself. So yeah, that is it for the... Um, updates and yeah, I wish we will show you guys and how we did it. Hello, Hi. so update about the wallpaper. Andito si Kuya Jung with me. Hi. 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 Hi.
about. So, we have this wallpaper right here. Dalawa siya. 4 meters siya in the shade of oak. Basta ilalagay ko na lang kung magkano ito sa... Dito sa baba. Basta ilalagay ko kung magkano yan. So ngayon, we're just going to measure our table so that we can be able to accurately put these babies. There has been change of plans. There are the shelves right there. We decided to build on them now, get started on them from a guide that we found on YouTube, and we headed to the mall to do some shopping. Hello, everyone. Surprise, surprise. We're on our way again to the mall. Actually, we're in the mall right now because we're going to buy some organizers and my office chair for my room. I'm really excited on what they have in store. Also, share ko lang. Sabi ni guard, may baby face daw ako. So, ayun. Happy times lang. Nakakatuwa. <laughs> so, yeah. We're going down and I'm with my parents right now. And I hope this all works. The reason we're also here is because in our area, electricity is out for like a few hours and we don't want to be bored and being hot and stuff. So, yeah. I'll talk to you guys later. Anyways, during that time, we found a chair. And that chair is pretty neat. And look at me spin. Whee! We then went to Miniso to find some cute organizers, pretty neat organizers for my stickers and etc. and some stuff. And we had some pretty good finds, to be honest. And we also went to the National Bookstore to get some file stuff, my ball pens. You know, because I do have a lot of papers from studying. <laughs> And while we were shopping, we found some Demon Slayer stuff. Unfortunately, we weren't able to eat there though, but they're so cute! And then we headed home. By the way, I would like to give a huge shout out to Kuya Pidoy for helping us with the whole process, especially with the flooring, and look how gorgeous it all became. The very next day, the package arrived, which is the grid, the white grid, because we tried to paint and we thought that the paint might chip so we just decided to buy a new one and it's very pretty overall. It's much bigger though than what I originally anticipated but it works better and we'll show you guys that later. Today is such a crazy day everyone because we prepared the shelves and we also prepared the stuff temporarily because the next day I have classes. Yeah. Thank you. 
Hello everyone and uh, I know that it's been like a very very confusing video because I wasn't able to record much because of the fact that it took so long to really set things up like this so I wasn't able to record that because we were all so busy but the desk right now is much cleaner than ever and I'm really happy about it I'm really satisfied so far and right now it is February 28th and tomorrow is March 1 which is the first day of my second semester once again so I wasn't able to finish everything really within the whole month but majority at least were able to finish it so that I could prepare myself for classes so at the moment right now I am fixing the letters that I got from conventions um, art prints just a lot of art prints letters Polaroids art prints Polaroid letters these stuff um, so shout out to conventions Kasi kayo po ang nagpapasimuno ng aking collection ng art prints. And I'm gonna be putting a few art prints on my vision board that I presented a while ago. And yeah, that's pretty much what I'm going to explain right now. There's so much things happening. We still have to do a few things. The blinds, we're still waiting on the foam. And yeah, that's pretty much what we need to do. And other stuff on Shopee such as the tapestry that I'm waiting for. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I don't know what this is today. I'm just gonna set things up, I guess. Since I do not have anything Jujutsu Kaisen related onto my vision board because I recently loved that anime a whole lot, I created pictures of Mahito and Sukuna who are respected to be my favorite characters because I love villains and a motivational quote, we gotta do that. And I cut them to like squares and stuff and you know, they're just pretty neat. Ayan na po. Oh. <laughs> po, ito na po yung customized foam na kinuha namin from Yuratex. It took around one week, no? One week? Around one week para maano ito. So, if you want to have a custom foam, magtanong lang kayo sa Yuratex para doon. Mag-recommend lang ako the one week nila gagawin ito. Kaya, mag-antay lang kayo ng patiently. So, i-unravel na natin. <laughs> I know, it seems weird. Why did I eliminate everything again? Here's the thing, blinds are going to be installed today. We're just waiting on them today and we just eliminated everything for now. The reason that I even set up in the first place because classes are about to start that time. So I had to prepare and we have to remove everything again just for the blinds later on. I'm really excited for them. I chose a gray one and I will link the shop which is Messiah's Korean Blinds in the description below if you also want to put some Korean blinds onto your room. So far, it's still a bit, but blinds there would make everything better. So we're just waiting on them. I still have classes later though. Let's see how it works. Oh, 
I wanted to upload this video as soon as possible because I'll be very busy this March. Like from the start, pala, I just feel worried already. Ang dami kong workload, so I just wanted to upload this straight and as soon as possible. As soon as the blinds went up and the bed is here, because I really wanted to, you know, wait on the tapestry and the final look will be shown pretty much soon while we set things up still. So yeah, that is the end of the room makeover part two. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure you like this video, comment down below, subscribe to my channel as well if you want to see more you know videos about me maybe doing stuff maybe i'll do some study videos pretty much soon because i really need to get back on track <laughs> and this is might be the only way to motivate myself i've been watching a lot of study vlogs recently because they're just very aesthetic they keep me safe and yeah i will see you guys in the next video and kisses well bye bye